India, a large country of many peoples. Among its numerous communities are Lotha, Khedia and Shobo tribes, the most primitive aboriginal communities. Lodhas mainly reside in the district of Mitnapur, bordering the neighboring state of Odisha, and some of them are also reside in the district of Makura. Kheriyas, they live mainly in the Makura district, then their adjoining district Purulia, which is bordering the state of Bihar. This Bihar is a, is a bordering area of this Purulia, then Birbhum, then Malda. Then it also stays the West Dinajpur and up to they just below the Darjeeling district is the Bihar state. So, so the many of the Kheriyas and Lodhas they migrated to this Jalpaiguri tea garden areas and they a, a substantial portion they live in this tea gardens area. Ancient Sanskrit literature and the Chorjapod have described this Shavur community as the inhabitants of forest hilly areas. This community belongs to the proto-Australoid species according to anthropological classification. The anthropologists think. From an anthropological point of view, Loda, Kheria and Savor are three different and distinct tribal communities. Loda and Kheria, they are clubbed together under one category, but Savar is a different community and they think that they are higher than the Loda and Kheria in Odisha. No, no, they should not be grouped together. Loda is separate, Kheria is separate. But Savar term is generic term. They can both them, them can use it. So, when many of the Lodas were not enumerated as Lodha, they preferred to identify themselves as Savar. So there is a difference between the Lodha, Savar and Kheria, but just because of social stigma, the criminality, this Lodha people identify themselves as Savar and also the Kheria people, they also identify themselves as Savar and it's very interesting that both Lodha and Kheria, they use Savar as their caste name and caste title. According to the Shabors, their original habitat was in the Nilgiri Hills area of southern India. They believe that Lord Jagannath of Sri Khetru is their presiding tribal deity. Vishabashu, the leader of the Shabars, used to worship the Lord. Some say that the Shabars originated from those who carried the huge stones for the Puri temple and pulled the chariot of Lord Jagannath. Even today, the Shabars are still carrying on this tenuous task of pulling the chariot quite sincerely. But in 1952, this Lodha has been identified as tribe and in 1957 it was included as scheduled tribe.